feel that the process of ISM turning into UWC is really a very interesting one, that the changes are actually kind of incremental. It's not a massive overhaul because when the UWC people came to see us, what they were looking for were the same values that they currently have and they saw them in the school. So really what's been happening is an intensification of those values to the diversity of having the National Committee students join our already existing cohort. The transition of ISM into UWC East Africa and the transition of Kenneth Tomazo from normal students into UWC students. Thank you. Hello, my name is James Carson. I'm the Head of Languages at UWC EA. Um, Albi has asked me the question of how do I feel about teaching students from different countries. Um, so I'm really enjoying being here. This is my first year at UWC EA. I was at UWC SEA before that in Singapore. So I'm quite used to the UWC way of doing things. Um, and they're very, very different schools, but they're also very similar at the same time because there's so much cultural diversity um, which brings so much to the classroom. People can share their experiences from the past, they can talk about their own countries, they can discuss different perspectives and different ways of doing things um, and just having all these students from different countries just makes the classroom so much more lively, so much more interesting, so much nicer to be in. Um, I enjoy having the UWC scholars around as well I enjoy all the students, but the scholars as well, because they're all very sociable, very driven, very nice people who want to do something good in the world. Um, so I'm really enjoying being here at my second UWC, and I hope I'm here for a while. I think it's amazing what we have here. It's crazy how we study with people from everywhere. Like a couple of days ago, I sat in a room, I'm Israeli, with another Israeli, two um, Iraqians and a, Pakistan, and a Pakistani girl. And it's something that never happens like anywhere else except for here and all the cultures and the people, everyone's so nice and it's amazing. Uh, for me it's like this UWC feels like my home. Even I don't want to go back to Mongolia because it already became my home. And then the, the environment, this UWC environment is like way better than any, anywhere else, UWC East Africa. You can find this environment everywhere. Can you find this environment in UWC Japan? No. 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 Yeah. And especially the people, teachers, students, the workers, like they're all, all of them are nice. Like in Mongolia, you won't meet a people like that. But here, I love them. They love me. I'm graduating here so I got to see the change from ISM to UWC and I think it's, it's a very positive step in the right direction in terms of uh, you know bringing the world together and encouraging diversity and everything. I've met a lot of new people from a lot of new places. So. I'm a UWC EA student at United World College East Africa. Uh, being, I've been in school for a long time, it used to be called ISM, and now, now ISM has always been diverse, but now it's even more diverse because of UWC. And this makes me feel connected to the world, even though I'm in Tanzania, in like one country, in one place. 
makes me feel connected to the world as we have the diversity of the students, you know, different different accents, different opinions, different ideas, you know, different cultures, you know, just it's lovely. I think the best part about meeting new people at this school is you get to learn about different cultures and especially because of the transition between ISM and UWC. Um, more cultures come in so you get to learn about more cultures and the community just becomes more diverse. It's fun seeing the school go from uh, ISM which is already very diver diverse and then GWCEA where you get a lot more cultures and you get a lot more people so you get to meet new people and learn a lot more just from the students. Yeah. Okay so um, I used to be in ISM before and <laughs> me too, I also was. And I guess like I'm just really excited for the school to become a UWC because we got to see and meet so many new people from all around the world, so many different cultures, so many different traditions. And we just like it was just really exciting to see so many people come together for education and bring their own opinions and ideas for a better future. So yeah. I also agree with that, and um, I think it's a super cool, you know, opportunity um, for all of us to be together and to live next to each other and to share ideas and thoughts and become more open-minded. Yes. like amazing about this because like it's so funny that you have like so many people here and they are, all of them are different and you know, sometimes it's hard of course but like in majority of situations it's just like so cool and so amazing that you can I don't think that I even know like is, is it reality or is it a dream so like uh -huh. and about this what will happen now I think it's the most important day uh, for this whole of these two years so this day is amazing, yeah, to all of us. And I feel great about this day. I'm so glad it came. <laughs> yeah, I'm so happy I'm in this school, UWC. It's so nice. Well, basically, personally, this school is the best, the best of the best. UWC, diverse, different countries, different people from different backgrounds. Knowing new things, knowing different people from different cultures look at me. Like, so today is a really good day. We are actually becoming a UWC. It's a really great day for us. And uh, it's a happy day. I'm really proud of 50 the years. school. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. 50 years. 50 oh. years, bro. Oh.